You guys seeing this right now? Cuddly cuties. Yummy milky and chocolatey candy. It's an owl because I'm smart. And it says you're a hoot. You can't see that. You're a hoot. You can get a monkey or an owl or a polar bear or a frog or a dog. Yeah. If I sound really tired right now, that's because I am. Because I've been doing homework for a while now. A lot of homework. You might not see another video after this, so my vloggy video thing might be pretty short. Uh, unless I have free time to actually eat uh, this guy right here. If I actually have free time to eat him, then maybe I'll, you'll see a little bit, a clip of me eating him, or eating the last bit of him anyways. Or maybe even, maybe even me up really late at night doing more homework. <laughs> because that's, that's what it's come down to. I have three photography assignments due in a week from now. This is a Tuesday. So, March 1st. <sighs> and... I have a bunch of, I have 14 more music assignments due by Monday at 11.59 p.m. Last day of February. Ooh, buddy. And I have a science test on Friday, um, which I did the practice test for pretty easily, though, so that's good. So I'm feeling pretty good about that test. I have review tomorrow. Uh, but I have a lot of photos to take. That's the big one. Like, I need to get this done. I really need to get these these guys done. So, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'll be doing that. I'm actually going to get started on that right now. Uh, on taking more photos that I need to take. And then I'm going to print those off at work. Well, the ones I need, I need 8x10s on actual photo paper. And I need to take those and get those printed off while I'm at work. Of course, I'll have to pay for them. Uh, that's not going to be fun, but whatevs. Whatevs. That's another thing about this class. I have to pay to get it done. And that's not fun. My little brother's at his championship game for districts right now. Basketball. Um, playing the Eagles, and we're also the Eagles, so it's Eagles versus Eagles. I'm hoping they win. They usually win games when I'm not there. So, well, they've won. But all the games I've s seen them play except uh, except one, they've won those games. There's one game they've lost when I, when I was there. So that's exciting. And all that good stuff. So I hope they win. I hope they're district champs. If they're not, then hey, they got second place. And that's really cool. They get they still get an award and stuff. Uh, basketball's not even our sport anyways. Baseball is totally our sport. Uh, well, it depends on the year, but yeah, I'd say I'd say baseball is definitely our sport. It was my sport anyways. I loved it. It's totally awesome. Uh, but I'm gonna go get some Pepsi. And start taking some photos. Yay. Well, actually, just any caffeinated drink. Because I need energy. Uh, and I can't take any... I can't drink energy drinks or anything like that. Because it might make my heart explode. Because of uh, heart problems. So, can't do that. I have to drink caffeine. Or eat candy. I can eat this owl. Maybe that'll give me some energy. If I can make it through the owl. Oh, no, I have to make a video for today, too. That's something I should do. I should probably do that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Don't call don't go to college, kids. I've been using this guy a lot today. I have to take a lot of photos. Luckily, I'm done with clothing. Then I had to take pictures of fruit and metal. Let me show you. I'm not going to show you what I took photos of, but I had to do food. And I still need to do metal. But I'm done. 
with one and two, this is number three, have to be done with that by Tuesday, getting it done tomorrow night, printing off everything I need to be printed uh, Sunday. So that's cool. Sunday, which I'll just do at work. So that's cool. All right, curtains are closed. That's good. I'm super tired because of all the work I've had to be doing. Uh, I think I'm going to go to bed after this. Probably not. I need to get some music homework done. But then again, I might watch Naruto. I might do both. I might do some homework and watch Naruto. It's, it's hard to decide. But I have work at 10, so I should probably do like a thing of homework and then go to bed. Uh, but now that I think about it, I kind of just want to go to bed. So, but I have some things to talk about and show you. So, let's do that. Like, for instance, my little baby brother. He's my baby brother. Why are you playing, baby brother? Why are you playing? What are you playing, baby brother? Supercell? That's a weird game. Oh, Boom Beach. He's playing Boom Beach. He doesn't. Do you like being on camera? Look how long his hair is. Super long. Ow. <laughs> He's also got big muscles. Flex for us. Show us your abs. You want to show us, show us the abs? Do that. Show us your abs. Hey. Hey. Hey, Talon. 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 <laughs> no lat. Hey, no lat. <laughs> Remember when you used to spell your name like that? Guys, he used to spell his name no lat. He used to spell it backwards. Wait, didn't you spell it backwards because they made you right with your right hand? And you're a lefty? <laughs> That's not why. What What did you do when they made you write with your right hand? I said no. You said no? I know they tried to get you to write with your right hand, but that was dumb because he's a lefty. It made no sense. But I have more to show you besides my little baby butler and his St. Louis Cardinal shirt. See that? That's a cool one. It's sky blue with the St. Louis logo. Can't really see the St. Louis logo though. But yeah, I have something to show you guys. Let me explain something first. Um, here, I'll grab it as I talk. Uh, I have to turn my light on. Oh, there it is. Cool. Easy to get to. Alright. Oh, look at that. Midnight already. He's hanging off of my lamp. That's all good. Uh, <clears throat> okay, this morning. <clears throat> well, here, let me explain some other stuff. Earlier this week, I ran into two friends of mine uh, at the student center. Uh, and I think it's okay to say their names, Cole and Mark. We watched some uh, Parks and Recreation together. It's the second time I've seen both of them on campus at the same time. And actually talk to them. Uh, second time total, second time this semester. Uh, so that was cool. Uh, and then I saw them on Wednesday, and we hung out for a long time. We went and ate Chinese, we went to GameStop, we went to the mall. Uh, and then we went to the relaxation room at Pitt, where we go at the student center. That was really cool, because there were massage chairs, and they were awesome. Percussion was the best one by far. They were right. Golemar told me that percussion was the best, and they weren't kidding. That was awesome. Um, we got in there. There was another girl in there. supposed to stay quiet and not use your phones or anything like that. But uh, they were making some noises whenever percussion was going on and some other stuff was going on. It was funny. Uh, but sometimes it feels so good that it will make you make noises. And... Uh, <laughs> uh, like, oh, was the one I wanted to make a lot because it was getting uh, right on the spine with the percussion or whenever I was getting it right like in the shoulder blades and the neck. That was, that was, uh, that was pretty good. It felt good, but felt, it hurt at the same time. Uh, but now that I know about it, like I heard about it, but I wasn't sure where it was and I didn't do enough exploring to find it. 
Now I know where it is, and I'm going to be spending some time there. <laughs> and then we played shuffleboard, and that was pretty fun. Uh, it's been a long time since I played shuffleboard. Probably since I was like eight, so. Uh, and I don't even know where I played it. <laughs> the, it wasn't on a college campus, but this one was. Then we met their Indian friend, who's older than all of us. This is his first semester, I think, though. We met his uh, Indian, their, their Indian friend, I guess. Uh, he's a very nice guy, very good host. Uh, uh, name is name is Harkeet, was his name. Very nice guy. And a great host. He gave us a really, he gave us this stuff that looked like sawdust. Uh, but it tasted like vanilla cotton candy. Very good. It was really dry, and then you put it in your mouth, and it's really, it's not as sticky as cotton candy, but it's sticky and wet now, and it's like, whoa, that was complete, completely different from what you were expecting, and it was good. Uh, then he gave us, <laughs> uh, they pulled out, he pulled out some barbecue Pringles, and we were like, oh, is that also an Indian food? But that was just us joking around. But, uh, <laughs> Then he gave us some more Indian food. It was like peanut brittle, all right? Whereas like, you know, there's nuts in it. But instead of like the brown, like crunchiness around the peanuts, it was like this dark brown, like hard, like caramel or something. I don't know exactly what it was, uh, but that stuff was good. I, I ate a little bit while we were there and I'm like, I don't want to overdo myself. So I waited until my stomach set a little bit, and as I was driving home at like 10 at night, uh, I ate it on the way home. That stuff was good. Uh, let me see how long I've been recording. <sighs> okay, we're good. <laughs> um, and we watched hockey while we were there. Uh, he's got a nice little place just uh, right across the street from the tech center. Nice little quaint place. Uh, my favorite snack of the night he gave us was like uh, like a mix of like a bunch of nuts and stuff with like the sesame sticks. Um, it had like peanuts and almonds and all that good stuff. Uh, huh. That was that was pretty awesome because that was really good. I'm, like, I'm gonna go try and like find this by myself because I'm not the biggest almond fan, but I had I was like you know what maybe a spicy almond would be really good. It was freaking good. Spicy peanut, really good. Sesame sticks, I'm not really that used to. Spicy sesame stick? Dude, wow, that was great. That was yummy. Very yummy. Um, and uh, then he showed us a sport that he played, that they play over in India called uh, Kapiti. Uh, Kapiti? I think that's what it was, Kapiti. Uh, if I'm remembering it right, I'm probably getting a lot of stuff wrong, but that's okay. And, uh, that's all I remember anyways, besides, you know, him being a really nice guy and shaking his hand whenever I met him, and also as we left, shaking his hand. Uh, uh, awesome guy. I really, uh, so first, like, actual Indian guy I met. Uh, and now I think I'm getting close to the end, so hold on a second, yo. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. As some of you would know, uh on one of my commentaries for The Division, I had a I'm losing it commentary where I really lost it whenever a bunch of homework just hit me all at once. And I'm very tired because I've been doing a lot of that. And uh, I've also been doing a lot of relaxing because of that. Uh, but luckily some of the work, like I thought this work was going to be like a lot of hard work. There is a lot of hard work involved, but luckily... Not all of it is actually really that hard. Some of those assignments are pretty short or easy. There's been a lot of easy assignments. More easier, easy ones than I thought there was going to be. Uh, particularly like music class. I was like, oh man, these are going to be... I expected maybe oh, some of those things to be long, but they weren't. They were actually pretty short. So I was happy with that. I was like, oh, okay. I'm still not done. I still have like at least 12 assignments left to do in music. By February 29th at 11.59pm. So that's fun. Uh, but I'll get those done. 
And then I have some photo stuff to do, but I'm actually getting pretty good headway on that. I'm gonna get those done. Uh, I'm very happy that I'm so close to being done with all this stuff. So then I can find time to actually spend some time with friends and stuff like that. Uh, I think my little bro my little brother's team they got second in district, so that was pretty cool. Uh, we were wanting them to do you know better, uh, obviously, but that's okay. That's okay that way that they got got second. Uh, that's pretty good, better than my middle any of the. Times I was in middle school, my 7th grade and 8th grade year, better than both both of those years, so that's good. And then uh, our high school boys were beaten in the first game, I think. And uh, I don't really know about the high school girls. I know they won their first game. I don't know about their second game. They might have won two games and then got beaten in their third game. I don't know. Uh, I wasn't really paying too much attention to that. I was just worried about little brother, like... One in the win districts, but they didn't. But that's okay. Uh, second place, that's pretty good. Uh, you know, that's not. Uh, it's not last place. Not last. So that's good. But uh, super generative, if you can't tell. Can't wait to have more free time to play some video games and watch more Naruto, and uh, also watch other things too, like funny YouTube videos, stuff like that. Oh, also, Colin Mark made me get a Tinder. Uh, don't I don't swipe right very often, at least in this location, uh, or in Pittsburgh, Kansas, where I go to school. Don't swipe right a lot. I don't. I look at them just like, huh. I read the description. I look at all the photos, and I'm like, uh, nope. Uh, I might be I, I might be a shallow guy, and I think Tinder is showing me that. That I'm actually a very shallow guy. I'm not really. I don't think. Maybe I might be. But I'm not really using Tinder for its intended purposes. I'm using it to, uh, like what we were doing, make fun of some of the people on there. Uh, but not in a mean way. Of course, not in a mean way. Uh, I did report a girl. But that was just for jokes, so... Uh, it has nothing to do with her actual profile or anything like that. Like, if they see the report and actually try to go investigate it, they'll be like, makes no sense, why he, Why would he report for this? So, that's all good. Uh, just messing around, because... Uh, actually, I haven't been on it at all since... Pro no, okay, I got on it the day after, but that's the last time. So I used it the day I got it and the day after. I haven't been on it after that, because... I don't see the point in it, but I can see why it's fun for other people. It's all good. But back to what I was getting earlier, the thing I got out of my bedroom from earlier in the video. Uh, Mark texted me earlier today, asked me when I was, like, if I had a class. And I told him, it was like noon. Yeah. Uh, how, he asked how, like, how long it was going to be. I was like, I don't know. I have a test. So it could be like 12.30. It could be like 12.50. Who knows? And he's like, oh, okay. And uh, then I get a really, I didn't get a reply back from him. For a while. So, uh, I come back to my truck after my test, and I'm getting in my car, and there's an orange note, uh, an orange piece of paper underneath my windshield wiper. And I was like, oh no, is this a ticket? I was, I was like, oh no, this is gonna, this is gonna suck. Uh, it wasn't a ticket. When I opened it up, I figured that out. Uh, here, I'll reveal it to you. Uh, let me, let me do the refilling, okay? I had it in my hands, and I did this, okay? I opened that up, and then I opened this up. And, uh, that's what it was. It was, uh, <laughs> it was this, guys. That right there. A drawing of a wing-wang, a schlingling, a dingling, a donger. A donger and uh, a hairy ball sack. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, obviously, it's not a ticket. I'll get that off screen now. Sorry. Uh, but I had to show that for the video. And now I will throw it away or frame it. Uh, just so I can show Mark that I enjoyed his little gift. I texted him that. I was like, thanks for the gift, LOL. 
uh, and this was one of the, this was one of the rare times where I actually had a smile on my face at least when I was typing LOL. Usually when people type LOL or haha or LMAO or LMFAO or LMBO or uh, Raffle or Rafflecopter or uh, LOL 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 uh, you know stuff like that or like you know laughing face or whatever. Uh, it's usually they type the uh, type it with a face like this. Like, they saw and they're like, hmm, LOL, or haha, -ha. LMAO, not really, not really doing that, or Raffle, not really doing that either, just typing it in, so, uh, but I actually had a smile on my face when I texted him that, and he said no problem and sent me back a winky face emoji, yeah, uh, but, uh, I'm gonna hang out with those guys more often, because, uh, we realized that I've only actually hung out with those two and me with them twice now, total, ever. We've hung out at other places together with other people around and uh, seen each other around places and stuff like that before, all kinds of times. You know, being like at, like at church things and stuff like that, you know. Uh, they're good friends of mine. I really, uh... It's just not, they're just not friends that I really hang out with a lot, but that needs to change. That's what Cole said. He's like, well, that's, that's going to change. He's like, we need to hang out more often. And I agreed because these guys are, are awesome. They're good friends and they're funny and I enjoy hanging out with them. So, uh, we're going to make that a thing where I hang out with them more often. So, uh, be prepared for more stories with them because they're funny and, uh, uh, well, just, you know, awesome guys, fun guys to hang out with, so, uh, really, if I just hung out with more people, I'd have more stuff to talk about, but, uh, hey, at least I'll start to hang out with some more people, and these are actually guys that go to my, the same college as I do, so it'll be easier, uh, and all that good stuff. Of course, once college stuff, once I get in the rhythm of things, like, hey, there's a spring break coming up, hang out with my friends, have all kinds of good fun, and uh, all, all kinds of awesome stuff will happen. But now I've been talking too much. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the picture of that. I wasn't sure if I wanted to actually show it in the video or not. But I was like, I don't care. I'm going to show it because it's something that happened in my week. So might as well, right? Might as well show it. And I need to finish some work. But I'm just going to go to bed. I'll finish my work later. I gotta go to work in the morning, so that'll be fun. But uh, hey, money, right? That's that's fun. But uh, you guys have an amazing rest of your day slash night, week, I don't know. Uh, have a good whatever it is. Whatever it is, hope it's a good one. And uh, toodaloo.